Hey guys, welcome back to another Monsters video. So in today's video, we're going to be checking out this new Football Time Challenge uh, tokens. I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know how to get the tokens, obviously. And on top of that, we've got a new team race. I'm going to go ahead and review the team race monster and let you guys know if the monster is actually worth picking up. And also, your finding Iron Wings, which is one of the best ancestral attackers or ancestral monsters in general, is actually out in the treasure cave. I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know if it's actually worth it. So I hope you guys are excited. If you are, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. Anyways, let's go and get started. All right, so let's go ahead and claim this first start off with that and we have 44 gems i want to see what we have in the treasure cave so take a look at this guys this is a new monster nomads uh place marathon now i would say i'm a bit late in this marathon but it's never it's never too late you know what i mean uh so the suspenseful guitar music announces a fearsome new barbarian monster waiting the marathon this new mythic monster apparently it's a light and earth tank with taunt healing sandstone quicksand and blind immunity skills so it's basically a tank with like healing abilities and torture abilities uh you also have so for the trait you have a mountain which is actually pretty good we haven't seen mountain on a monster especially a tank in a very long time so it's nice to see this uh being returned because it's actually not that bad immune to tortures that's actually really good for taunt or a tank in general gains taunt at the start of the battle now that right there i don't know about that to be honest the fact that it's a status caster and who knows it might actually just last one turn so because of that because it's not a trade i'm not sure if the monster is really worth 85 laps that's up to you guys to decide i personally wouldn't uh but if you want to go for you know 85 laps go for it i want to see what uh some of the top teams are going for so let's say for example team spirit 2015 i want to see where team spirit is currently at you know what's crazy i don't see team spirit at all guys i don't see him in the top 100 at all meaning that they are not even uh going for 85 laps first of all uh because if they were going going for 85 laps normally uh that team actually pushes really really quickly um and then obviously uh some other teams like for example let me see uh i don't know high voltage I've, i don't even ever heard of that no offense i've never heard of it if anybody's from there uh i have yeah so this right here they're going for 43 laps so maybe 85 there mighty monsters they're actually going for probably 60 to 85 champs is going right now it's at 24 i'm not sure how many they're going for but obviously kv racers is always are going for first place getting that 3000 glitch shrines with 800 summoning tickets it's honestly insane to me like i mean i understand like uh this isn't like in a negative way i'm just saying like if i were in kb races right like every single race i'm talking about like since last year i'm pretty sure right if i remember this right it was like i believe winter time or close to winter time i remember uh kb racers was actually like going um they, they decided to go for first place um i remember i got an invitation for their first race but i unfortunately declined but um they decided to go for 200 laps and they've been going at it for the past i don't know how many races but it's insane to me like do, do they not get bored of going for 200 laps i feel like race it's not about boring actually it's about like the, the, like the fact that it's really like tiring you know what i mean like the fact that it's every race you're going for two two three hundred laps probably more depends on who's gonna give you a hard time um definitely 200 minimum right so look okay so these past few races actually they've been oh never mind okay so it seems like uh just for the past few races you're, they're just been going for over 100 laps but even even for over 100 laps that's still insane to me this is really impressive i'm not hating or anything i'm just saying this is really impressive but i feel like it can get very tiring and also a lot of time and resources being consumed as well, as well right like this arcanite one this right here i don't understand why they went for 200 laps for arcanite because the monster obviously uh sucks uh most of these previous like monsters except this one right here this one was actually worth it in my opinion maybe my go to i don't know for 200 uh, 129 laps i mean i don't know but you guys you guys decide on that uh but that's about it honestly and um i, I would say uh for this current you know team or current race that they're going for first place again so uh they might just go for glitch i think that's what they're doing they're just trying to gain first place just for glitch and also the fact that it's actually world record what they've done the past uh so many races they've just like stayed and maintained first place it's in, it's honestly insane it's very impressive uh looks like we actually have a marathon uh not marathon sorry we have a football time challenge what the heck is this but there's a football <laughs> what okay so uh looks like they're giving you some valentine's coins that you can actually use there's obviously tickets and then there's 400 seasonal summon tickets so it says 10 hunt or send 10 hunt uh run down the field of monster wood and watch ads to advance towards a goal and collect unbelievable rewards hey we all know the ads are the best part right 
I don't know about that, to be honest. But it looks like if you can get 10 tokens, you can get yourself 400 seasonal summon tickets, which is actually insane to me. Like, that's really good. Uh, so, obviously, you're not going to be able to get the tokens every time. Looks like you might actually get one of these chests, which is actually kind of annoying. I see why they actually did that. It's, uh, it's to basically get players to keep on watching more ads, which is fair. You know what I mean? That way, they actually make more money, more money basically. Uh, but, yeah, let's see. We also have a breeding event right now going on, guys. In this breeding event, I am going to see what I... Let me see. I don't have this monster. I could probably go ahead and start breeding it. That's going to be a day and eight hours. I do want to check out what we have here in the treasure cave. Grafani is here. No way. One of the best ancestrals, guys. What? All right. That is actually nice. Now, this offer is actually not that bad. Grammy rank 3 plus the 2,700 gems. That's... Uh, I would say... It's, I don't know, it's up to you, honestly. It's up to you. Um, I mean... You know, the 50 bucks normally gets gets you 1,700 gems, uh, but for 100 bucks, you're getting a rank 3 monster that's actually pretty decent, and obviously 2,700 gems altogether. So that's up to you guys if you want to make that decision. It's it's not entirely bad of a deal. It looks like this time challenge for the football is just like a mini sh like short event that they're doing. All you, all you have to do is watch Monster Wood ads get the tokens and basically get yourself some cool rewards i really like the final reward the fact that they're giving you 400 of the actual like seasonal tickets which is actually really good you know what i mean that you can actually use um also grafania guys if you could go for room 60 uh go for it the monster is actually worth it just the egg if you're missing the egg and you your luck has been really bad for the past you know uh, whatever amount of um, which you might call it conjuring events and tickets that you've spent then i would i would recommend it you know what i mean uh, i would say go for go for it uh if you can room 60 try to try to see if you can actually get up there the monster is worth like 300 gems i would say in my opinion 300 gems what do you guys think um so here i'm just gonna go ahead and uh, get hit with the trap and i'm gonna go ahead and continue obviously I'm going to keep on going with room, uh, not room, but pot three and see if I can actually make it uh, really high up. We made it to room 10, which is really nice. So here I'm just going to go and press next. We got Mauser cells there, some glitch rinds and stuff. I might get hit with a trap here very soon, I feel like. I think this one right here. Oh, what? No, okay. Okay, so it looks like uh, our account's actually a bit bugged right now, guys. This actually happens to me sometimes where I'm actually able to make it really high up, really far up, which is going with, uh, which am I call it pot three and it actually works for me so as you can see we made it to room 15 with only five gems being spent okay now 10 gems um but basically my point is that uh our, our account's actually a bit bugged which is actually good uh it's a good thing um i might get hit with a trap oh wow they actually suspected me now okay maybe maybe um maybe that was bad so i could get myself 10 gems or 11 gems and then keep on going if i want to i can make it room 20 uh shall we do that all right i decided to do it anyways uh so i went ahead and restarted my game so that way we don't really lose uh, our progress in the uh which might call a treasure cave so that way we can actually uh return back whenever we want obviously so i just need 11 gems i, I just need to uh, you know earn 11 gems here and there one way or the other so it looks like uh, we just have to collect food so i'm gonna go ahead and call it out and do two there it is collect food oh that's not enough food oh am i not growing um a good amount let me see so i'll do grow food and i'll do what is it so they, they asked i don't know how much it actually asked for let me see uh it shouldn't yeah it shouldn't be more than like 20k or sorry 50k so it's 30k i can actually do this one which is one hour which is gonna cost me one gem no i didn't mean to do that hold on okay that was the one i'll go ahead and repeat that but anyways i completed the uh rewards there or the the race but i need to let now i need 12 gems oh yeah i was able to actually get 16 gems out of one survey this is what i'm telling you guys like whenever you need gems and it needs to be like quick just like that uh you can basically just go ahead and try out uh you know multiple surveys but anyways looks like they're actually giving you that one robot dog monster which is actually not worth it at all by the way room 30 the only reason why i'm doing this is just uh to see how far i can actually get with just uh going with pot three obviously so anyways uh pot three here we got 25 tickets i'll actually take that i mean why not and then we have room 20 room 20 ladies and gentlemen it looks like they're not actually giving us any good rewards i'm just gonna go ahead and press next and i think this should actually be the time where we back out because all the rewards we're getting here are actually not that great um or maybe we should keep going what do you guys think should we keep going i don't know i'm like like kind of tempted to keep going man 
Uh, I'm gonna go with this one. No, you, that's crazy. That's actually insane to me. Like, the fact that I went with the other one twice, the chances of it actually dropping on the one all the way to the right should have been high. I don't understand why they didn't actually put a trap there, and instead they put a trap on room three or pot three. I, I seriously don't understand that. Uh, but anyways, I'm robbed with all my gems. Um, and plus, I, I actually don't really care about that because I, I, all the rewards that I actually got up to that point weren't really worth the uh, the gems I spent or, or just to collect anyways. So I honestly, as in, I wasn't as as bad honestly. If it was maybe 200 tickets, sure. Uh, or 400 tickets, yeah, heck yeah. But uh, no, I'm, I'm fine. Uh, but anyways, look like they're actually giving you some Fritos cells. We might as well go ahead and actually purchase this for Team Race. Uh, when it comes down to like ranking uh, rare monsters, uh, this is actually good to pick up. Uh, not just rare monsters in general, but like rare earth. This is actually one of the best. Um, it, it's actually the best monster to actually rank up when it comes down to that. So we might as well go ahead and basically just uh, buy all that till it's actually sold out. We also got this monster to rank four. We might as well go ahead and feed it up. As you can see, the stats are all the way up. And so we're going to go ahead and collect this level nine rune. Oh, wait. No, I should have actually spent my jumps on the rune experience thing that's going on right now. The rune experience event. Oh, I've been I've been wanting to actually do that for a while now. Okay, so you know what that means, right? That means uh, we can either wait for a offer that's actually going to be happening here um yeah either we wait for an offer not an offer like this as it's too expensive uh, we wait for a regular offer and then i'm gonna go ahead and actually take advantage of the rune experience which uh as you see let me see how long is this left two days and ten hours we have a lot of time uh but we'll just wait and see um i do want to check to see what the football event actually gives again so there's five gems that's the only gems you're getting oh, that, well that's that's stupid that's really bad at least give us like 10 20 gems like the the food challenge gives you 20 20 gems the the goal challenge also gives you 20 gems like seriously and this one i feel like it's more difficult because you're watching ads and like there's gonna be a lot of ads you have to get through it's not just 10 ads by the way you gotta watch more than 10 unless you're super lucky and, and you get the football final tokens every single ad that you watch so yeah, it can't be difficult, by the way. But anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's Monster Gens video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. Anyway, this is so and peace out. Okay.